and today we are going to solve two questions of Indian Forest Service IFOS 2021 and paper 1 and question number 8b as well as 8c so first of all let us see question number 8b find the initial basic feasible solution of the following transportation problem using Vogel's approximation method so we have to find only initial basic feasible solution we do not uh, have to the Modi method or we do not have to do the some uh, final correction so this is the thing so let's start what to do so first of all in this kind of problem draw a cross line this is the factory capacity is given and this is the warehouse requirement is given and uh, from factory 1 to warehouse 1 what will be the transportation cost associated cost it is given and corresponding to uh, the different warehouse and different factories is given so first of all what to do in this kind of problem do the total factory capacity summation of all the factory capacity that is come out to be 500 here do the summation the requirement is also coming out to 500 that means this is a balanced transportation problem if the capacity is less or uh, requirement is less or that was for example if the capacity was 450 then we have to add a dummy capacity okay or if the requirement is less than the 500 then we have to add dummy requirement which whose uh, transportation cost is zero zero but here it is a balance so nothing to worry about it now what to do leave some space over here and do the column wise first in first column see which, which which one is the least value that is 29 and the next value is 30 so what is the difference difference is the higher next higher most value from lowest in first column the lowest value is 29 the next highest value is 30 so what is the difference it is 1 so leave some space write down here 1 again see the second column least value is 25 the next value is 26 so difference is 1 now again go to here the least value in this third column is 35 and the second value that is 37 that is the difference is 2 now see this here least value is 20 but next uh, higher value is 30 so difference is 10 now the similar way do the in row wise least value is 20 first row and the next value is 25 so difference is 5 here the least value is 26 and yes, the second most is 29 so 3 and here 30 least value and the next most value is 31 so difference is 1 now see from these differences which difference is highest 10 so select that difference and which corresponding to which column or which row so this is the fourth column so in the fourth column whichever has the less transportation cost assign the requirement so here a 20 is the least select the highest value of the difference and in that corresponding column select the least value this thing you have to keep in the mind the difference should be high and the value that we have to assign is less the least value so 20 is the least value and uh, the requirement is 50 but factory one can supply 100 so i can give here a 50 the 50 requirement so this requirement is zero and now the factory has 50 units left so this about this column is now zero this column is cut zero now uh, nothing to do with this fourth column so we can cut out now do the same process again take the difference so here the difference will be remain same one one two but in row the difference may, may get change here the difference is the difference is again five the difference here again is three but here the difference will a uh, difference of two 31 and 33 so difference is two now which one is the highest value the 5 is the highest value so select this row first row and corresponding to the least value is 25 so 25 is how much requirement 160 but here it can uh, the factory one can supply only 50 units so assign 50 units and mark as a zero and how much requirement left 110 so the work of this row is now over now again do the same um, different difference 29 minus 31 to 26 minus 33 that is uh, 7 again 35 minus 37 to 
and the difference in row wise again 3 and 2 so which one is the highest value the 7 is the highest value so corresponding column is second column so second column has the least value 26 26 and it has a requirement 110 but factory 2 can supply 250 so we can give all 110 requirement over here so the remaining quantity is 140 so about so this columns work is also completed now again so difference is 2 but in row wise the two rows will be there 29 minus 35 so that is 6 and 31 minus 37 that is also 6 so take now this is a tie so what to do take the least value so from this 29 31 37 35 the 29 is the least value so how much is its requirement 90 warehouse one requirement is 90 so it is 90 now 50 remaining then the next most value so this this requirement will over now we have two value assigned 35 and 37 so 35 we can assign as a 50 because one factory 2 has only 50 capacity and the 37 remaining unit is sent by factory 3 so to complete the requirement of 200 so this is this how we can allocate the locations now what to do initial basic feasible solution so what is the transportation cost so transportation cost tc will be 25 into 50 this is the unit the cost of the 30 25 40 the unit that is given to uh, that is the transportation cost from uh, factory 1 to warehouse 1 that is the cost of one unit so we have 25 cost and 50 units plus 20 units into 50 units plus 29 and 40 units plus 26 into 110 units plus 35 into 50 units plus 37 into 150 units sorry 37 into 150 units and that's it so when you do this as summation you will get as a 14,120 so 14,120 rupees is the initial basic solution so this is the thing that you have to find i hope you understand how to do this kind of problems in vogel's approximation next is the question 8c from paper 1 here are the four different jobs are done on the diff different different machines and the setup and production time is we have to uh, there is a uh, one thing is given the setup and production times are prohibitively high for change over the following table indicates the cost of producing job on i machine on uh, job i on the jth machine in rupees so this is a uh, at rupees the cost of production that is a five seven so if first job is made on first machine that is the cost is five rupees if the first job is made on second machine the, the cost is seven rupees so assign the job in different machines so that the total cost is minimized so this is the assignment problem and this is a minimization problem so no need to worry about it the all the so this is a standard matrix so what to do as per the johnson's formula sorry johnson's method first do row reduction so select the minimum value of the first row and subtract it from the remaining values of that similar row so from 5 0 7 minus 5 2 11 minus 5 6 6 minus 5 1 now in second row what is the minimum value 5 subtract it from the other remaining value that is 3 0 char 1 here 5 again 1 2 0 2 in here the least value is 3 that is 7 1 5 0 now what is the rule to see is the each row has at least one zero and each column has at least one zero that condition is satisfied now uh, cover all the zeros with horizontal and vertical lines with the line should be minimum and the minimum line should be such that it should cover all the zeros and number of lines must be is equal to the number of zeros so here that condition is also satisfied that we have covered horizontal or vertical you can select or horizontal or vertical you can select combination of it also horizontal as well as vertical but you cannot select inclined so now what to do is uh, here the number of lines are also satisfied the four zeros are there and four numbers of lines are there so that is uh, also satisfied 
now assign the zero in such a way that each row and each column contain only one zero so that here first row has one zero second row is one zero third row is one zero fourth row is one zero and if you look wise column wise then first column has that is one second third and fourth so that is a satisfied answer not, not uh, to do any plus minus additional steps so this is the end of this question so just assign write down here first job here job and machine first job first machine and cost is five rupees second job on second machine cost is five rupees third job on third machine cost is five rupees fourth job on fourth machine cost is three rupees that is 18 rupees cost to 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 total cost that is minimum the total cost is minimized so total minimum cost is 18 rupees so this is the answer and this is a 10 marks question very easy question not to do anything else just uh, raw reduction formula and uh, look at the all the row and all the column contains at least one zero then do the horizontal or vertical lines in such a manner that it will cover all the zeros and the line should be minimum number of possible lines we should not do maximum the line should be minimum and the line should be uh, the number of lines should be num is equal to number of zeros okay so now this is the end of this question and uh, i hope you enjoy this solution if you have any doubt you can ask in the comment section and uh, we will meet tomorrow on a new video so thank you for watching and subscribe this channel for upcoming this kind of